Hi. Wave. Okay, we're gonna have to talk, probably talk louder today since we have the camera further back. Yeah. We need to get a microphone. Yeah. We're not really that organized. <laughs> yeah. When are we ever we'll organized? We'll be good. We'll be, be good. Fine, yeah. So we're at um, Shining Soul in Old Town Manassas I know, today. I love this place. Um, One of my favorite spots. Yes, in Becky has a lot of. Um, I do. Well, I, and I sell these candles in my shops. Them. Yes. Pete and I have known each other forever. And this is Pete, so. one yep. of the How owners. How you guys doing? He's also a local uh, celebrity. Uh, yes. Well, in case uh, you didn't know. Today I'm a candle Wait, maker. Wait, we gotta tell. Uh, you have to expand upon that. Oh well, will you get mad at me if I say? Uh, yeah, yeah, you'll be upset. You'll be upset. Yeah. Okay, do it. Thank <laughs> you for really, attention. Definitely do so it. So Pete is the lead guitarist and singer in the Brett Michaels band, which um, tours all over the country, all over the world. Oh, Were you on world. Rock of Love? Yeah, I was on. He Rock was on Rock of Love. <laughs> he was. I, I met Mindy. Oh, did you? Yeah. Mindy, Mindy's sweet. Oh. She's great. We still talk to her sometimes. Yeah, she was. Yes. Uh, she was at a like did an appearance. I was, I was like, I gotta go see her. I love Mindy. Oh, that show was great. I love that show. Whenever I'm on Rock of Love, I was on Rock of Love, and then shortly after, endorsed. <laughs> <laughs> we need to do a new one. <laughs> Rock of Love, Manassas. Yes. <laughs> So, um, so yeah, why don't you, is there anything that you want to tell us about the store? I'm sure Becky can Oh my help, God, I love it. Well, help draw out some uh, Like I said, I, I sell these candles in my little boutiques because I love them. My daughter and I spent like two hours here this summer <laughs> going through and smelling almost every single candle and we love them. We love them. They're just awesome. And um, they are amazing. The Woodwick candles, like I wasn't sure about that when I first saw those. No, and, no one ever is. Yeah, and I love them. That's been the, the biggest challenge actually is... Uh, convincing people to uh, give that a shot. To just you know? try it. And yeah. it's not very uncommon. Everyone talks about it being new. And we've been doing this for seven years. I mean, yeah. This is my eighth year now using the Woodwick. And it was it started a couple years before me. There were some other companies doing it. Uh, but it, it, that's the interesting challenge sometimes. Yeah. But it's a more eco-friendly thing. And uh, there's some other benefits to it. So once you once you hook people on it, I think that they... Uh, they get it and they, they appreciate it. So what's their issue with it? Is it just like, just, oh my gosh, why would you burn a piece of wood? No, it's just burn it's away. Just different. Oh, yeah, okay. Different. Well, and yeah. I, I actually, my mom was like, oh, it's gonna smell Thank like you. something's burning. You sure, know? sure. And it Thanks, doesn't. Jason. It doesn't at all. It doesn't smell except in, if you get the one that smells like a fireplace. And it smells like something burning. <laughs> yeah, <fireplace>. exactly. <laughs> there was a. We had a great commercial. Yes. With a great, with a great don't look that. it up. It is not. <laughs> oh, I like oh. the smell of a wood burning well, candle. I want to see this. We have to no, play it. I'm going Gainesville. It's going to go. Oh, please don't. Please don't. Uh, not my friend. Pete called me and said, Can you be in a commercial? I said, You know, I'm a singer, not an actor, right? Hey. <laughs> he was like, Are you free? And I'm like, It's yes. the same thing. The, the, I'll be these, there. these days, the entertainment industry encompasses everything. Yeah, you got to If you're do a it. singer, you're an actor. If you're an actor, you're a singer. Yeah, yeah. yeah. you got to be the trio. No, and, and now, uh, now I'm. Doing a guest hosting. Yeah. Who, would have, who would have thought? <laughs> I'd probably be a better actor now if we did it again. You want to shoot another one? Sure. All right. Sure, this time you, you can pick the camera. Can I be the lead this time? Yes. Weren't you the lead in the last one? Well, I didn't have any real speaking roles. Oh. Well, your, your, your friend that looks like Guy Fieri did. Oh, that's right. <laughs> that's hilarious. <laughs> yeah. Um, let's stop talking about that because people might actually look it up. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Um, so yeah, tell us anything more about the store that you want to like. You've been around. How long have you guys been in this location? Uh, I know you just, said seven years. Well, but I, I started. The candle, I started the company seven years ago, almost eight years ago, and um, we uh, we've been in this store just over three years. A couple weeks ago was our three year anniversary. Oh cool! Yeah. And it's super cute. And Old Town Manassas. If you haven't been in Old Town Manassas, there's a great restaurants and. Um, Breweries and all kinds of fun oh, stuff yeah. going on here. So, and then it's it Friday all the time. First Fridays, it's first Fridays, yeah, they and they shut down great. the streets, yeah. and you can walk around with your drinks. And yeah, now you can drink in the streets. I'm never home on a Friday. Yeah, so. and you can bring your drinks in the stores, right? Oh yeah, yeah. 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 Such a fun idea. Yeah. That's yeah. awesome. I love it. I actually, I get jealous. I, again, I'm always on tour uh, on the weekends, but I watch the cameras on these last two Fridays that they can drink. And everybody's having and fun. Everyone's in here partying at like 11 o'clock in my store, and I'm like, man, I'm sitting in a You'll be here one Friday. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and then we'll do some live music or something. That'd be great. Yeah. Awesome. <laughs> awesome. Well, well, you guys are doing um, the United We Fight um, Sit, cause. Right there. With your candles. Or, no, are you going to talk about this? I'm going to let Richard talk about it. Okay. Um, Ray. Yeah. Oh, Ray. Oh. <laughs> Come on, Ray. Ray doesn't know this, but... And, 
To anyone that is commenting, it's really hard for me to see today since it's far. It so is. We've got a lot. I can look. All right, let's see. Yeah, we got all sorts of people in, in the house today. Oh, ask about Brett Michaels. Yeah, <laughs> what, what more about Brett Michaels? No, I can tell you something. He smells really good. He smells really, really good. Like, oh wait, we everybody get, asks me what's he's like. What is he like? I say he's really nice. But, and you know, and he's, we gotta get Ray in. You know, though, that's his clone, his own. Clone. Yeah, yeah. Roses, and, roses thorns. and thorns. And then we make the candle roses and thorns of that smell. Oh, oh okay. I need to get one of those. Yeah, that's right. That's, right. that's on my true. list. All right, so I'm gonna get out of the way. Yeah, we're kicking you I'm out. Right. I'm gone. All right. <laughs> Thank you guys for having. Thank you. <laughs> Thanks for having us down. All right, here comes Ray. Here's Ray. Hi. Ray Madonna. Hello. <laughs> the Welcome. face of the company. Yes. <laughs> yes. And when you come in here, he's usually playing guitar and rocking out. Yeah, absolutely. And At least beating and, on the camera. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and I brought my daughter here this uh, this summer to pick out the candles, and he helped her make a candle, and it, it was she, that was like her favorite thing she did all summer. She loved it, and it, and you made her feel so special because she could create her own scent and her own colors, and she loved it. So if you have kids, you can bring them up here and make their own candles, and it's an awesome experience. They just love it. And it just, Adults, too. I mean, yeah, my kids like, like to put their down. fingers in the wax of yeah. the candles, and they yeah. love it there. No. It, it, took, it took off when we made it a, 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 a fixture Hi, in here. It just it started and started and got better and better, and now it took off, so make your own it's candles awesome. for everybody. Plus, we do... Wicks and sips that we do oh, with Moray yeah. and several wineries around the area. And how yeah. often do you guys do that? Um, quite often. Um, we don't put them all in a line, okay. so it becomes more special. Right. Okay. But uh, Cindy does a great job with doing that and space awesome. them out every two weeks. Well, let so. Leslie and I know when you're going to have them, and we'll we'll give the shout out on Wednesdays before you do it. Yeah. And and Wicks and which... sips dot com too. That'll oh, be okay. Too. Awesome. Okay, cool. And what um, wineries and breweries have you guys been at? Uh, Just are you usually in the Manassas area? Or are you all over the place? Amore is down the street. We do it there, or she does it there. Um, the wineries are more out. There's one in Bealton. Oh, and you're putting oh, me on the spot because I don't remember. No, it's okay. No, okay. I don't. More, it's Mariah or whatever. Mariah. 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 Yes. 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 Yeah. And then there's another one up towards Leesburg. Oh, okay. Um, so um, that's become uh, more and more a thing that, that she's doing because the wineries. What they do is wigs and sips. Yeah, so it's something fun to do while is. you're there. Yeah. Than just I happen to know adding drink. extra stuff to do at while wineries. drinking <laughs> works well. Yeah, you know, <laughs> who doesn't want to play with hot wax and drink? I know, right? Right. <laughs> right. It's all fun. And the candles that come out of it, you never know. It's creative or oh, they're yeah. terrible. <laughs> you know, some people, even over here, some, yeah. of the, some of the scents that people want to do, you know, they'll put together, and you'll be at first. You'll be like, I don't know if I do that, and then they'll do one like uh, like Fireside and Almond. Who would put those two together? But you and do, it and out it's nice. just like, yeah, it oh, wow. amazing. Yeah, I put uh, gasoline and uh, and bacon together, and it smelled amazing. <laughs> I would like <laughs> that. I swear to God, okay. I think I would actually. It's I nice like, for a garage. It's like it's a dude gift. It is a definitely <laughs> or a dude bacon gift. and money. Ooh, no. here we go. That's it. Money. Anything in bacon. Anything in yeah. money. That's, that's, money. True. that's true. No, oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> no, Jim, I'm kidding. Jim Talbot somewhere in Manassas clapping right now. <laughs> yes, so let's talk more about United We Fight. Okay. It's an amazing cause that you guys are supporting um, by selling your candles. I know you're putting, it's like 25%, I believe, of the profits. Uh, of the 20? net proceeds. So yeah, 25%. Okay. Um, there, we have this candle. Um, this is our Dragon's Lair, which is it's our best seller um, in, in its form as Dragon's Lair. Um, the other one is the pink one right behind me. Look at that. I'm like, I have a couple of them. And this in my is bag sea, sea salt and orchid. That this. one smells so really good. And this is actually the scent of our other best seller, which is a mermaid tail. Oh, okay. been a mermaid's cove. The tail. I Dude, just did a unicorn and a mermaid thing. But uh, so there, there are two best-selling scents, and oh, this is yes, the cocoa, the cocoa one. Uh, and then that's the cocoa. So you found a cocoa. Yeah. Look at that. Well, chocolate. Was, is that limited edition? A fancy uh, one. You know what? It's not limited edition, but since we oh, have only great. like two or three of them, I guess it would be limited edition. And now it is. They're gone. I think. But that's chocolate scent. So yeah, it, just it joined, smells so good. It just joined us. Uh, the, the, Try that one out. Like maybe a week ago. Oh, that's nice, isn't, isn't it? Good? Yeah, that's really nice. So, so yeah, for these 25% of the net proceeds, these go. Which is a lot. That's huge yeah. for yeah. Awesome. a lot of companies. It's like, you know, 
well, one of way the, less. So. Right. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And we won't mention any, but, you know, you want, when you say proceeds are going to, you want them to actually be going to, and you right. want to give a good portion yeah. of it. Um, right now, it being uh, Breast Cancer Awareness Month in October, um, we're really pushing, pushing, pushing. Right. But we are doing this outside of those two. We were doing it last month. We'll be doing it in November. And, and we just keep doing That's it. That's awesome. Absolutely. That's awesome. It's, it's a great cause. So it's just an ongoing an ongoing mm-hmm. cause you guys support. There's no time limit on, on it or anything like no, that. No. It's all for six just weeks keeps, we're doing this. No. It yeah. keeps going. That's awesome. It keeps going. And it's, uh, you know, the cause isn't going to stop. So why would we? Exactly. Know? I love That's it. awesome. I, love I know. It. I love that thought process. So, and, and it's really just to raise money for um, the Prevent Cancer Foundation? Right. So they, uh, and you know, this is the little uh, sheet, you know, the, the spec The backwards sheet and that they the, always na- <laughs> How do I do that to make it great? But uh, I- anyway, it is, and, and we have this explained every time you get a candle, one of these. Well, yeah, well, we'll, put, we'll put that up on the site. Yeah, so the there you go. Yeah. And everybody look at it because it's, it's really a, a great place to go. Uh, preventcancer.org is, is the place to go. Yeah, to, and it's uh, got a, what, research, education, outreach, and advocacy are yeah. the main uh, it's huge. Points and, and of, it's, uh, they cover. you know, that they have so many things, you know, the American Cancer Society and all that, treating uh, and cures and stuff like that for cancer. But with this, it's prevent cancer. That's so awesome. what, what are we going to do to, to prevent cancer? What, what are you going to do? Change your diet, change your exercise, change whatever to make sure you don't, you know, or at least, you know, Self do your exams, best to not. All that oh, stuff. yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Mammogram. <laughs> well, like did you want to also one. talk about this a little bit? So this, um, and uh, I'll tie that right into the to, to the uh, prevent cancer. Um, we're going to have, a, we're doing a lot of, it's autumn, it's fall, so we're doing a lot of festivals. Um, our affiliate, uh, Richard, he is going to be at the Lake Ridge Fall Festival this Saturday. And this is also backwards. Yeah, but it's, it's okay, just... It's, yeah. it's, Put the phone in the mirror. It's at the <laughs> LRPRA parking lot. It's uh, it's this Saturday, and it's the Lake Ridge Fall Festival. And so, there's free pony rides. Yes, so it says it right there, free pony rides. <laughs> free pony rides 10 to 12, so I can take 10 to 12 pony rides. <laughs> I'll take 12. <laughs> anyway, vendors, games, arts and crafts. It's going to be a great time. It's it's outside, um, hoping for great weather. Um, but Rich will be there and he will have our candles, um, shining soul candles, uh, the dragon's lair, the mermaids, the Shenandoah. It's a great fall oh, scent. That one. Absolutely. And I'm then of sad. course we have all of our other fall scents that, uh, that do great. Toasted pumpkin crunch, autumn oh, chill, taste of neat. autumn. All of them. Whole right, latte love. Whole latte yes. love. Yes. Right. Yes. 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 I smell a lot. Oh, I already have a batch on the counter that I'm getting. So <laughs> can't be here You do. Yeah. They're yes. right over there waiting for I'll you. probably get a couple more. <laughs> got to stock up when I'm here. Everybody should come down and stock up on your fall. And I say that for two reasons. Number one, fall uh, is seems like it's starting to get cold now. So winter will probably come quicker mm-hmm. than fall came to summer, if that makes any yeah. sense. And also Halloween, we have great Halloween candles. Oh, they're we really have, cute. Oh, Jack. Yeah, yeah, I was going to say. So here's Jack. Can you cute. go get me a boo? So oh, Jack no. and boo are actually... And these aren't backwards. <laughs> no, I mean, a face is a face. So Jack and boo, and uh, these are, are creations of our wonderful uh, crew so of owners, uh, yeah, Pete and Darren and Sarah. And they all came together, and they're like, you know what, we're going to make Jack, and we're going to make boo. And, and it's like a That's family That's actually thing. not true at all. Those are all just my idea. <laughs> they Pete's idea. He was on a plane, and he had his phone on uh, airplane mode, so nobody could call him, and he had this thought. Connected that to gonna, Wi-Fi. Con- yes, no. connected <laughs> to Wi-Fi. No cellular data. But anyway, so that became the... Uh, the brainchild and what's the of all one with the, uh, the vampire fangs in it? That one's really you cute, bring too. That too. Yeah. So, so my point of all of this, what I'm doing now, all is because this Halloween's one. right around the corner. Dracula's Cozy Crypt. So this one's oh, really this cute. This is amazing. Oh, so look, it has... This is a Darren. It has fang little fang marks, marks in it. it. Isn't that cute? That's a, that's a Darren brainchild. And this one mm. smells... What did I say? This, this smells amazing. like Georgetown in the 90s. That's what yeah. I told them. It's very, <laughs> like, like, that's very specific. It's very... Um, oh, absolutely. Like, there you um, go. That's why I said Pete, Darren, Sarah. Um, I said all three of them? Yeah. It smells like incense. It's yeah. like... It's kind of like... 
but not like super hippie and so things. Sarah it's decided. Very subtle. Well, and Sarah decided it would be very cool to put Fang marks in there. That's I love that. The That's really cute. And color them red. That's really cute. So again, you know, you can see that it's in there. And that's amongst the uh, the hey, other ones that we have that are Halloween. And Halloween's right around the corner. What well, brings me around to the whole point of that is once it's gone, it's gone. Now, Jack and Boo, Dracula, um, Witches Brew, all of that. Yeah. It'll be back next next Halloween, maybe, or we'll have new ones. Yeah. Awesome. So it's best to get them while we have them. We do have plenty of them now. Uh, Richard will have plenty of them at the uh, Lake Ridge Fall Festival. And you can buy them online, too. And you can yes. go. So that's ShiningSoul.com, of course. Excellent. And uh, that way you, you can get them shipped all over. Um, if, if you live out of state and you can't get down here, go to ShiningSoul.com. Look at our store online. We've been, that, that, the online thing, that, that's been going on since 2012. So these awesome. were actually being poured in 2012 in, uh, in a basement and being sold online, and that's what really started yeah. everything yeah. and afforded us to be able to get it. If you can make it to the store, the store is really cute. I mean, yes. it's amazing. It's really cute and really you fun get to smell them And yes. then you get, yeah, you, get yes. to, you get to get nose on with the yeah, candles. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, and but, I mean, they're, well, I love it because not in a good way, they're very pungent. Yeah, you know, and they're strong, and when, I, when you light them in the house, you can smell them almost immediately, Yeah, and, it's, and it lasts. Yeah. So whenever I'm having a party, I, I light them like an hour before, and people walk in and they're like, "Oh my god, it smells amazing in here!" So right. love they them burn, they indoors. Burn balance, you know. Even it, if I wasn't your friend, I would like these candles. <laughs> <laughs> That's the most important thing. Amen. Yes. And it's a good balance, you know. There, people people are getting away from chemicals and toxins Absolutely. and stuff like that. These are 100% all natural. They're soy wax and they're wood wax. So there's no chance of lead being in the wax. There's awesome. no GMOs, no toxins. Right. And you have kids wax. and pets in the house. Yeah, it's, that, hey, yeah. it's actually, the pet thing's a big deal. Yeah. 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 Even, yeah. Pe even people that get headaches, some people are like, oh, I can't. They'll come yeah, in here. Yeah, they think it's and the scent. Like, I, it's I, I, can't, I can't be in here because, you know, candles give me headaches. Well, I'm like, well, you're in the right place because our candles won't, right? Right. And, you know, disclaimer, it, you know, it, somebody that's super sensitive right. might be sensitive to everything in the world. But these are better with that because yep. they're not yeah. putting toxins into the air that cause the migraines. Right. For pets. Yep. Like mentioned, yep. uh, it's great. It's 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 an all natural burn. It's an all an all natural breed. Yep, excellent. Yep. Well, we awesome. love you guys. Yes, well, thank we you love so you much. Too. Thank you for letting us be here and take over today. Yeah, we're taking over the shop. Yes. So if you do, it, did you have any? Thing no, you want to I talk mean, about? unless yeah, well, you need you, me over, here, so I want you good, all to you can, converse. Yes, feel free to hang out with us if you want. Us, you're more than welcome. You can jump in. Well, I usually talk about all the music that's happening in the area. So if you want to jump in and talk about music, you're you're more than welcome to, Pete, as well. You guys have Amen. some knowledge. You might even recognize some of these names of people that are playing. I think I think Bart's playing. Uh, where did I see him? He's playing. We're all good friends with Bart from Junk Food, and he's playing. I saw him. I saw him. She's like, oh, wait. I Junk Food. Wrong in here. batch. Wrong batch. Yeah, I know. Um, he's playing Friday at 6 p.m. at Velocity Wings. So, <laughs> oh, that's how that came. Is yes, that, yeah, that's yeah, how that came. There you go. The tangent about the the velocity waves. No, that's um, on Friday. That's on Friday at six p.m. And since we're here in yeah. Old Town, we'll talk about Sinistral. One Hot Mess is playing at Sinistral Friday at six thirty. They're so good. Oh yeah. They're uh, they're friends of mine. They're awesome. Um, and then uh, today at seven p.m. over at Sinistral, which is literally like right around the corner, it's Hopademic is their trivia night. Uh, Sunday at 2, they have Pints and Painting event at Sinistral, and you want to do some? Yeah, I'll t well, I've got Gainesville. So oh, oh, okay, so do you might as well just do yeah, an access then. Okay. Um, let's see. I have my yeah, you'll want to oh, skip probably this is fun. Usually, um, I like Ross stuff like uh, that. Friday at 5 is a 90s Halloween bash at Skate and Fun Zone. That's good for the kids. Uh, yeah, Absolutely. yeah, so that's fun. <laughs> um, apparently, they're having like um, parties there on weekends for yes. booze. So oh, I'm, I didn't oh, know the booze oh, part. That, that could be yes, dangerous. You probably have to sign a really That's good disclaimer. Right I'll be like <laughs> a waiver. I'll be like yes, we running, it, running into all the walls. I know. No. I know. <laughs> um, Saturday at eight a.m. is the Manassas Farmers Market. Um, let's see. Yeah, we don't want that. No, actually, no. Yeah. It's just like a is. real estate conference. Um, awesome. Okay, skate and fun zone at seven p.m. is an '80s back to. Um, skate back to the 80s event um, and then um, let's see tucked away brewing company has a fall paint night 
I still Friday gotta go seven. over there. I've said that a million times. I know. So I'm going to talk to that. I don't even know where that is. And I think I said it's, it to you every time. It's such a way. <laughs> it find it. Um, Farmer's Market, we already talked about. Let's see. Well, um, at same at uh, Tucked Away Brewing Company, Sunday at 3 is a cornhole tournament. And then we're jumping into Farm Brew Live, which I pulled up on here so I wouldn't have to go back and forth. Uh, Bill Twildy is playing today at 5. He's awesome. I've known him for like 20 years. He's which, amazing. Which Farm Brew Live, though? Farm Brew Live. So Farm Brew Live is the here in the It's two silos. The farm at Broad Run is in Haymarket. Right. So, which there's an excellent band playing there yes. on Saturday, yes. which we'll get to. Dang it. <laughs> and <laughs> another really Shady cool club. event on the 19th. Uh, Ryan Forrester duo is tomorrow at 5. Also excellent, excellent band. That guy can sing his email <clears> off. Uh, Jim Steele, Friday at 2 p.m. Johnny Artist Band, Friday at 6.30. They've been around forever. Yes. James Stevens, Saturday at 11. He is awesome. Randy Thompson, Saturday at 3. And I think that's it for Farm Brew Live at Two Silos. Awesome. And I think it's going to be a busy weekend. Yeah, there's a lot going on. Um, let's see. More tucked away. Yeah. Okay. I didn't do my papers this week like I was supposed yeah, to. So yeah, it's okay. I'm a little unorganized. I did get my printer fixed, though. Oh, okay. so, well, that's good. Yes, I had band practice, and one of the guys fixed it for me. So, um, Oh, Two Roads Tap Takeover is at Monza, Friday at 530. Um, for, uh, for their beers and stellar food. Um, there's a holiday bazaar at St. Thomas at 9 a.m. on the 19th. And that's it for Manchester. Wow, All right. that's a lot. <coughs> that's Manchester. a lot. That's a yeah. good weekend yeah. right there. Yeah. I mean, mark down Monza, 6 p.m. When was that? Right. Tap takeover. <laughs> <laughs> so um, one of my friends that does well, that I do a lot of networking with, um, Jill Blocker, as well as um, Beth. I love Jill. Beth, what's Beth's last name? Calling Wood. She does the CBD store. Oh, okay. In, I don't know. She was in my she was in my last video too as my co-host. Oh. I'm drawing a blank on the last she part of her name. Just comment. Call, yeah. comment about it. <laughs> Anyways, <laughs> those two are together. They're doing the um it's like a a pause and pals one mile um and five K mutt strut coming up. And that's in gonna be at long part actually well, I'm skipping out of into Haymarket for a second, but that's Sunday, November 10th, so it's a lot of time, a lot of notice. It's not just this weekend, it's at 8.30. Um, they're looking for people to register to be part of the race. They have vendors there, pup kissing booth. Pup, they have a pup psychic. Oh my God. That's what I want to be, because nobody would know. I wouldn't have to be right. It's like the weatherman. Yeah. I yeah. have, have a, friend, I have a friend, friend of mine yeah, that's married to one of those. Oh, really? Oh, he just left the room. He's <laughs> <laughs> so like, I don't want to know what my dog knows about me. <laughs> right, right. So they're um, they're collecting at your CBD store located at one four six six two Lee Highway, um, dropping off donations. They're looking for um, peanut butter, Kong toys, dog waste bags, bleach, um, premium quality dog food, dog treats, collars and leashes, grooming supplies, wet cat food, kitten chow. So all kinds of stuff. We'll put up information so that you guys can look for that upcoming. Sounds like a cool event. Yeah, I think it's gonna be a lot of fun. Anything with anything with animals is yeah. gonna be fun. Absolutely. Um, Sunday at ten is the Gainesville Farmers Market. Um, I'm not. I don't know where that is. I think it's over by um, Heritage Hunt. Like it's a oh, Martin okay. Mark Key or Mark. Or oh, okay. Yeah. Um, and then I have on October 16th, which is today at 7.30, we have the Wednesday Night Line Dancing at Eclipse. Oh, yes. Which we will do eventually. <laughs> no, I actually went up there one night, but I didn't take part in the You didn't wear your boots. Dancing. No, I didn't wear my boots. I watched other people do it. <laughs> you watched other people do it. I'm um, good at watching when yeah. I dance. <laughs> October 19th, Saturday at 1 p.m., we have a mug mug club appreciation event at tin cannon so you can buy a mug there you have your own mug you're part like a membership there queenie you better be at this i just said that so i can tag you and make fun of you at the grizzlies practice tonight queenie. Oh. um <laughs> she has a mug um then we have the be be or uh, your band and be the star at club eclipse on tomorrow at 6 30. that's always fun yeah then there's, there's actually there actually oh, is a lot of talent at those events. Yeah, they're really talented. They what what like, is it? It's sort of like it's a like live band karaoke. Like, yeah, and so karaoke if you want to do a song, you kind of just let them know. They have like a big sheet, just like a karaoke would, and you jump up there and you can be the star. 
So it's it's cool. So the band's playing the song that you want to yep. sing. Yeah. You go yep. up there and do it. And I think they cool. allow the musicians too. Like if you know it on guitar, you can jump up there and play it. So wow. yeah, it's cool. It's cool. And when is that? Uh, every Thursday. Yeah, uh, we'll have to go up in there. Yeah. Megan might Megan might be part of Yes. <laughs> we'll have to ask for it. Yes, it's an awesome spot. Yeah, um, and then we have at uh, Out of the Blue, it's during football season on NFL game days all season long. It's buy one, get one, all you can eat blue crabs and um, blue wings. And then we've got, oh, this sounds fun, at Club Eclipse 2 on October 19th at 8 p.m. It's on Saturday, <clears throat> excuse me, as a murder mystery. Oh, that's fun. Yeah. I like those. That's something new, different to do. Um, a Hot Night, number one, and Haunted <coughs> Lorianne Woods in Gainesville. It's, um, I don't know, it's seven, parking's available at the commuter lot at 7787 Limestone Drive. We've got, let's see what else. We've got the DJ at Club Eclipse on the 18th at 9. Um, 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 let's see what else. Sorry, skipping through some of these. Um, Tin Cannon, tomorrow at 7 p.m. Um, is a trivia night. And then Julie Says No on um, I the I heard 18th. they're really good. Yeah, I, 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 know, yet, I know her. Oh, really? But I don't, I've not seen her they perform. Play all, they She's play all over the place, yeah. yeah. Uh, that's Friday at 7. And then, let's see here. We've got, I'll skip over those ones. Oh, what is the music one? Oh, was there Six, one? Six Shades of Grey? Oh, okay. And I think that might be some of the Yeah, and that's the that, Club Eclipse as yeah. well. Yeah. Um, Friday at 9 p.m., Six Shades of Grey. And I think, if I remember correctly, it's some of the people that got together doing that karaoke sort of thing, and then they formed a band because they like jamming together. That's it's, pretty cool. I think that's them. Yeah. Um, if it's not, I apologize. Oh, jeez. Trying to take on all the candles today. I know. <laughs> Six shades of gray. They're 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 missing forty four of them. <laughs> um, and then on the nineteenth, also Cabela's is having um, a Halloween event. So you go and you get a free four by six photo with the Peanuts gang, including Woodstock. So that was very important to know that. <laughs> Woodstock's gonna be there. Well, he's part of the um, game. Yeah, so, I know. Woodstock's oh, the unsung mean, hero. Woodstock, Woodstock is my favorite. Absolutely. How can he not be? <laughs> <laughs> All right, we've got so we got Gainesville. All right, Gainesville on to Haymarket. Down. My jam. That's why I wore my hat today. Yes, yeah. um, straight out of Haymarket. And, and I have some fun stuff going on <laughs> in Haymarket this weekend. So, um, let's see. There's a comparative uh, tasting series series at Winery at LaGrange, Friday at 7 p.m. Oh, wait, can I jump in and say yes, one thing? Yes, please. The 19th, sorry, it's at the same time as yours, so the people mm -hmm. on the Eastern end have to go to okay. the pony rides. Okay. But we're going to be on the Haymarket Day yes. float. Yes. We're going Gainesville, so come wow. to Haymarket yes. Day. Haymarket Day. We're going to be on the float, waving to everyone, yep. and some cool little surprises of what we're doing That's with it. Yeah, yeah. Yes. I've been working on like getting all my balloons and everything ready for it. So. Since we're local celebrities. Yeah. Yes, we yes, were yes. spotted last week. It was so ex it was so exciting. <laughs> and two people know who we are. Great. <laughs> yeah, so definitely come out. I mean, that's a great amount of yes. everybody in that area. So since we're talking about that, it kind of segues into See what you're doing, what we're doing. So as soon as we're done at Haymarket Day, we're heading right to the farm at uh, Brewery at Broad Run, where they are going. They have a new seltzer release, hard seltzer cocktail trio that are like mojito flavored, and I think it's mojito, margarita, and uh, Cosmo and they look amazing. Um, also, uh, Nelly Pop uh, Mobile Boutique trailer will be there um, all day Saturday for sure until nine. Sunday kind of depends on the weather, it might rain. Um, but we're gonna be there and we're gonna have all of our new fall stuff in. Uh oh, did we pause? No, we're, oh. Oh, did we pause for a second. Oh, okay. So this is one of the new items that just came in yesterday, the, the week ending sweatshirt. Um, we got in a bunch of new uh, fall vests. So you can only wear it during the week. Yes. <laughs> so you wish you were weekend. Yes. Um, uh, we got in jackets. We got in, oh my gosh, we got in so many, 50 new pieces of clothing. So the camper's going to be fully stocked with all that stuff. And, and we're going to be open. And super fun, cool stuff. Thank you. Yes, Thank I you. We that. do have accessories too, but everybody's been kind of going crazy over like the soft, fuzzy sweaters. We have those little, um, those little vests that feel like you're wearing a teddy bear. They're oh, like, like super cozy. Like and fleece. Yes, they're yeah. so wonderful. So the reason we're going to be open all day until 9 is because from 5 to 9, 8-Track Jones is playing. 
which is my favorite local band, obviously. Mine too. Mine too. Um, <laughs> we just added, um, this week at practice, we added five new songs. Um, all of them sound amazing. We've got Jonas Brothers and Justin Timberlake. And we're adding, because for a long time we were kind of an 80s, mostly 80s band that had a couple newer songs. So we've really been trying to get something from every year. You know, we have, you know, we do like Fall Out Boy from awesome. the early 2000s and uh, stuff like that. But we're trying to add in stuff that you hear on the radio right now. So, um, 8-Track Jones, 5 you to should, 9. Vicky. Let me, let me <laughs> have, you, have you played there? Um, I played acoustic there, but never with the full band. So, so we played there like three weeks ago, and it was absolutely, what a fantastic place. Isn't it place. such a great thing? It's so pretty. Staff, fantastic yes. ownership, management, everybody everything, there's great. Everything and, runs so smoothly. They really are. The and it's great where you're at. And they're actually... They're talking about sandproofing the inside. So that would be even nice. during oh, yeah. the winter when it gets cold. Yeah. Um, and they do that. That would be nice time. because yeah. it, it can get kind of loud. Right. It, it's a dog in there. Yeah. No, th this place but I still is, love it. It's phenomenal. Oh my gosh. It's, it's wonderful. <laughs> if and you it, haven't gone, definitely go and go on the day that Yes, yes. And bring playing. your lawn chairs or a picnic blanket because yeah, there's absolutely. a great big space. There's lots of seating, but it's mm -hmm. also nice to get right up by the stage. And, and it really is nice one of those places that I know. <laughs> there, and it really is one of those places where, you know, a lot of the breweries and wineries are like, oh, we're kid friendly or whatever, but they're oh, really no, not. This, this one really actually is. is. And it's safe. It's like away from the highway. The parking is kind of on the opposite side side so it really is they have this neat little it's not a playground but it's kind of like a rock playground and the kids love climbing on that stuff. and there's some that. animals that they can go back yeah, and look at it's in the fun, back, so it's fun. and then the, what is the roost that, that's like an adults only section yeah i haven't gone in there yet the yeah. once the one time i tried to go in there we're having like a private person oh, so i was like dang it but don't they know you're allowed to crash private parties that's yes, how you like, roll yes. that's how you roll <laughs> Plus, they don't know who you are so that's how <laughs> this weekend come, wear shop, a mask. come shop come watch some music and um and definitely go to haymarket day because that's a really fun thing for the kids Hi, i know a lot of the local Robert. businesses are going to be Presenting, I'm pretty sure Dogs Day Out is going to be there. A lot of the people that we've interviewed are going to be there. Oh yeah, um, I think they're having something coming up, but that it might yeah. not be this. It might not be part October or something yeah. like that. Yeah, oh yes, they're having an event. Um, Andrea Corey is helping organize. Yeah, that, so, she so can, look out. We'll be she talking can jump about in that and next talk about week that. Yep. for sure. Or, uh, so then we've got. Um, the Dominion Valley Fall Festival is happening, but I don't um, think that's... I don't want to talk about that. Oh, it's residents only. Yeah. Yep, never mind. Uh, la the last time they had a big festival like that, it was open to the public. Yeah, they so. have had some that are. Um, you then played that, didn't you? I did. Yes, I did. did. Yes, that was awesome. That, that was, was really You fun. didn't even realize that my band was playing inside Lion Bull. Oh, right? I didn't. Yeah, that was oh, us my gosh. setting up in Lion Bull. You all were outside, and when you all stopped... Eddie came over and, oh, nice. and <laughs> we oh, went the same way right yeah. into our show. Perfect, there. Yeah, perfect. That was great. Uh, we've got Yellow Tie Guys solo acoustic at, um, where is this one? Is uh, <laughs> Where is it? I know. Oh, at Haymarket Day. Oh, okay. He's playing at Haymarket Day, so that'll be fun. Um, yeah, they have, one of the first gigs I ever had was at Haymarket Day, and I was like, this is going to be so awesome. The people actually sat on bales of hay, and I was like, this wasn't the gig I was expecting. I was, I was looking for like <laughs> the, Verizon, the Verizon, the Verizon sound. Yeah, so I was like, um, but it turned out to be a great tailgate. Yeah, hay bales. it was one. It was, <laughs> the market wasn't like it is now. It was yeah. kind of, it was pretty country back then. Absolutely. Oh yeah. Um, That's where the good so we've got. Is. Um, <laughs> oh, uh, uh, Dog Stay Out has basic obedience training. Um, I think they have that every week. Yeah, I think um, they do too on Wednesdays. Um, let's see, October food truck at the farm brewery is, um, um, oh gosh, I can't oh, see it. Oh, it's cutting off. Well, they have a food truck there every year, or every, every weekend. Um, oh, Brian Frankie is playing at 6 to 9 at the farm brewery at Broad Run, uh, Friday at 6. And then we've got, um, Sunday Vineyard Tours at the winery at LaGrange, that's Sunday at 11. Uh, oh, and they were. I was just at the farm brewery yesterday, and they were saying that uh, Sundays for football are big. They've got the NFL Sunday ticket, uh, Sunday starting at one. Um, let's see, Alan Scott Band. Oh, I love Alan Scott Band. Have you seen them? Nope. Oh, they're so good. They've been around forever too. Um, Saturday at nine at Lion and Bowl, and then the Ted Feldman duo is Friday at eight at Lion and Bowl or L and B Tap Room as they call it now. Um, then we've got. They do. They go to L&B Tap. Yes, yep. they did a kind of they a re refresh remodel, and it's uh, it's they definitely have like a new menu and all kinds of cool new stuff. So, um, a lot more beers. A lot more beers. Oh, absolutely. Yeah. Um, Bobby G and the Heavies at Giuseppe, Giuseppe's for, uh, Saturday at four p.m. Um, 
But I already say Ted Feldman Friday eight. I think so. Maybe. Um, Haymarket uh, Flea Market Saturday at nine, which um, doesn't say where it is, but you can look and see. I'm usually more organized than this. I'm sorry. Um, Haymarket Day starts. Oh, it starts Saturday at nine. I thought it was really early. Saturday at nine's not bad. Well. That's what time do we have, have to be there? That's when the regular people have to be there. Uh-huh. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Leslie, I love you. <laughs> I got I got to play later. I got to work all day. <laughs> I'll be there at nine. I'll be getting I'll be someone ready I'll for, jump on the for Battlefield yeah. homecoming game. Oh, yeah. This is a busy weekend. It really is. It's, it's, it's I mean, everything crazy. you all have gone through and the three places that you've gone through it yeah. is tremendously busy. For yeah, and we didn't even yes. get to Warrington or, or <laughs> sometimes we wow. do. Um, little Warrenton. Um, well, I have, yeah, I have a couple has. different things at Warrenton yeah. that I'll go through real quick. Um, and then I think that's all I have. All right. Well, I'll just quick jump in here and talk about a couple more. Um, Saturday at three, we're into the Falkier area with in Warrenton. Saturday at three is a fall car show at Northside Twenty Nine Restaurant. So that's always fun. Um, drive on in with your classic car or come out to vote on your favorites. There's um, the Farmer's Market in downtown Warrington at, on the 19th at 8 a.m. And Old Busthead Benefit 5K on the 19th, Saturday at 11 a.m. That is obviously just um, a race. I guess you can have a beer afterwards, so it yes. makes you want to go faster. And you can get lunch at Farm Station Cafe, which I'm obsessed with. Yes, she is. I've been there at least once a week. And I am too, but it's so good. But. Yeah. Well, it's closer to me. Yeah. <laughs> a little... Well, I'm out there all the time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Um, and then we've got Deer and Tapscott live at Wild Hair in Warrington, the Cidery, at 7 p.m. Also, Power Fe- Powers Fest, Powers Farm Brewery, is in Midland. They're having their thing on the 19th. That's fun. Why do you have to have the same day? So there's market. so much going on. I know. Everything is like crisscrossing into the day. But hey, you know what? You want to have a fun weekend? We're all over the place. And then we've got. Join us for a walking tour of the Warrenton Cemetery on the 19th, too, at 2 p.m. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. That would be fun. Um, let's see here. Um, it might be kind of close to the end. Let's see. Fire Pit Friday at Vint Hill Craft Winery in Warrenton oh, at 6 that p.m. That, um, that's in, that, that would be nice and cozy and fun. They have a barbecue truck and then... I love that anywhere you want to go, any weekend in this area, there's always a winery, brewery, and a yeah, barbecue yeah. truck somewhere. Yes. Exactly. So you can always get something great to eat and drink. I love I love living here. Yeah, and I, that's that's about it. All right. We made awesome. it. Awesome. We made it. Um, can I do our... one last shameless plug? Of course. As well as Nolly Pop being at the Farm at Broad Run. We're at Vanish every weekend, just to let you know. Um, and there will be new fall stuff out there this weekend. Hopefully, I can get my act together. Um, and again, eat Trek Jones five to nine on Saturday night. Saturday and, and come and come vote. And come. Vote for us in our float. Oh, you can vote. Well, they have a. Well, I don't. That's fine. I, don't, I guess there's people that judge it. Oh. I'm just talking to the judges. Not the okay. Judges. All right. I have one more shameless little. Yeah, do it, please. Shining soul. So. Uh, as everybody knows, the Washington Nationals are yes. going Woo! to the World Series for the first time in franchise history. So throughout the World Series, ladies and gentlemen, come in with your Nats gear, Nats hat, Nats socks, Nats shirts, Nats whatever. Come in and we're going to give you 15% off of your purchase and that's going to happen from now until the end of the World Series. Go Nats! Yay. Absolutely. Do, 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 do. <laughs> all right. Thank you all so much. Yeah, thank, thank you guys. Thanks everybody, Thanks everybody for tuning in. Yes. Go out and have so much fun this weekend. Yes. Oh, so so many many things to do. Tag us, Beautiful. Bye. Bye.